everyone, I'm Coco Black and welcome to my tips and tricks for Minecraft Java Edition. Let's get started. This is a new game that I've been playing for a while now and I would leave a like if you would like to see more on my channel. Well, the, and the first step is to finding your flowers is to go to this billboard at Pharaoh's Workshop in Valder. You click and Jonas, these are your tasks. You need, Jonas needs netting, Conrad needs a burlap sack, and you need to be Star Rider for this. So you just tick every single one and you memorize them. Then you press OK. You come back over behind the back over here. Click on this worksheet one here. And you look for it. So I'm pretty sure the netting is here. So for this you will need a jute and a flax. And so we'll start with that one. So where to go to find his is first step you need to go to so make sure you're star right of this otherwise this will not work will not work you need to go into the trailer and you have to go down to hermit's cottage or if you have self who farm that will work as well okay so now make sure you're on the beach and now you just if you're at hermit's house you just have to go right so this way this way and then you just have to continue doing this until you have found some glistening sparkles. So there should be one. And the, you just have to play for 30 minutes, not around this area, not like not around this area, and then they turn up again. Fast mode this so you don't have to continue. It will be faster for you. Okay guys, looks like I'm not having that much luck finding one so far, so what you might have to, there's probably going to be something on the beach that has some sparkles. And then you just click on it with your hand and then it will pop up in your inventory like we have here. The next thing we'll be looking for is a flax. Okay. You just can call it the pickup, and wherever you, wherever it takes you, wherever your home symbol is, it will take you there. So you will need to go to Fort Pinter. This one. And then you will need to go to. And by the way. There is a like a chance they won't be here. They can be scattered around anywhere in your vic. So basically you just have to continue looking around. Okay. So what you want to do is that is where the horse market is. And then you just want to come this should normally okay, there's none here today, but the next spot you can look for is if you go continue riding so here's the path back to moorland you just want to cross through these two roads and then if you come this way and then jump now we're in the golden fields and then here right next to this area, right here, this is what you're looking for. So any one you can find will have these sparkles around it. And then to collect it, you just have to click on it like this. There you go. Now, let's head back. So, about there. Okay, we're coming back to Four Pinter to get into the wagon to go to Valdale, so it's a little bit faster instead of riding down. You just go into this trailer here, and it should be wherever you collected it. Mine's down the bottom, and you don't want to click on Valdale Lake, you want to click on Valdale Village. With your Vic shillings. Okay, now we are here. You want to go over here. 
Yeah. Okay, so what we need is a burlap sack, netting, and a paint set. Okay. So, you want to come to this first workbench here. You want to go all the way down. We need a netting, which we have the ingredients for. You press yes, and then your character does all the work to make it. Here is the netting. It will turn up in your inventory and it will be put back on your horse. Now we need to do the burlap sack, which is costs another jute as well. You press yes. And your character does it again. The last thing is a paint set. Let's see. Here. So for this one we need a rubia, rubber, and a moss. I don't know. Okay, let's go find ourselves some moss. Well, the moss is actually I in the same place you are, just in Valdale. And I will also so show you where the, you can find chamomile, like chamomile tea and things. Okay, so to find the moss, you basically just have to search around rocks and things. So, and trees and things like that. Okay, so. We will also show you where the chamomile is right now. So, it's quite simple. And I'm also going to be looking on my way for moss. So, but if you join, if you are still on the path which I am going back onto now, you will come up to this broken down abandoned house. And then you just want to go up here. And then around here, there should be and the mile where some is it seriously none for me to collect why is there none for me to collect okay sadly there is actually none Okay. Where would more be? I don't know. But that's where I've been going almost every single 30 minutes I've been on the game to get myself some chamomile. Now, the next thing you want to do is if we go head quickly back to the Valdale station, we will be able to f see who needs the netting or the burlap sack. And I will speed this up for you so you don't have to watch me just racing, racing through the woods. Okay, I am back in Val Valdale. Again, you want to go to the station and find out where it is. Find who needs what. So, Mr. Cod needs a paint set, but we weren't able to find any more, so we can't do that one. So we just need Conrad and Jonas. Okay, so let's go. First stop, we'll go to Jonas Hightower. To get to Jonas Hightower, you will need to go to South Hoof Farm. Just need to go in here and find South Hoof Farm. This one right here. Orphic. Or you can use the Ferry in Fort Pinsa if you don't want to pay money for it. Okay, next thing you want to do, you should be able to see this on your map. 
which is, um, so you can see down here, it has this little circle thing. And this is Jones. So you just need to go to this little mailbox, click on it, and it will put in, and then you just say yes. And then it'll give you that. Okay. Now, next up, more land. More land stables, or just more land. Again, go into your trailer, or again, however you got to your place, and then just go to more land. Okay. So, here we are. Now, as soon as you are in Moorland, you just need to go to this little blacksmith station. And you just click on this little mailbox and perfect. So, And now, if we go back to Vardale quickly, Vardale, and if you can't find any flax in the Fort Pinto area, you can. Go into the south area and just map the whole entire area and see. You will, if you have your music on, if you go to here, settings, sound, master volume on, you will hear like a da -da -da sound. And now if you come over here, you will have this bar up here. I've been doing this for like... I don't know how many days, and I have almost completed level four. Oh. And quickly, if you would like to donate things like flax, rubber, or anything to fair, these will also give you extra things. So, like, flax will give you 50 plus. But doing actual chores will give you a hundred. Okay, so we will let's go check out. We this will be have to check out one of these areas because there is flowers there. Okay. Here we are. So, we need to go to Jalheim, Jalheim, and then on this corner, take a right. And then, go this way. So, as you can tell, it looks a bit more fancy than normal, but we just have to go through here to get to one of the places where the flowers are. Okay, so you need to go through here, and then Right here, take a bite. Then you'll come to this dressage field. I'm just gonna go straight down the middle because I need to get we'll get there far it'll get there, us there faster. And here you go. Here is a B bomb. And as soon as you collected one, it will come up like a so much for watching this video on Star Stable. Please leave a like if you have enjoyed Star Stable and if I could should continue. Bye for now!